Oh, hey, I finally did this. <laughs> I didn't even realize it. Hello, everyone. Are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woken. I'm back with another Dracalia Lost video. Today, what's today's gonna video gonna be? Obviously, it's all about running Tartarus, a standard on auto. That's right. So, um, this is my auto uh, Tart team. Uh, I found this because Mayo linked me to something, but this was back before the Dragon Special. I think there's currently one up that is more consistent, but I don't have, um, I don't have the Gala Gene, so can't really run it, so I'm gonna go with this. And it's been working pretty good so far. It does take a very long time because it is defensive focused, um, so I'm just gonna grind. This is all stuff people already know, but this is basically my way of saying, like, hey, I am slowly... Slowly getting back on that grind. Okay, so that's yeah, that's gonna be today's video, everyone. I'm just gonna auto some E-Tart, not E-Tart, just regular Tart. Hello, sir. Hello, weird Darth Vader-looking man. Uh, go here, go here, go here. Here you go. Um, I don't have anyone's weapons so far. <laughs> Chances are, I have to build the weapons for these dudes first before I can actually start making the weapons. Um, the reason being is that, uh, well, it's gonna be good because, um, I've already resolved to the fact that I don't think I can use Galazena for the Lilla fight, so I'm gonna use someone else. I did see that people were already found a way to use Karina, which is the entire reason. Let me tell you right now, if you guys keep looking for ways to make Karina work in things that they specifically designed to not make her work, all that's gonna happen is that they're gonna nerf her, or they're gonna make events that literally no one can play, so... If I had one suggestion, it would be to stop? Maybe stop? Unless your entire intention is to keep using Karina until she gets nerfed. In which case, do what you want then. But... It's happened before in the past. It happened with Vice, so... It's not like they won't nerf a character. <laughs> and then give you some stuff in the back... Um, for doing it, but still. It's very interesting. Very interesting to see everything that's kind of popped up for it. I'm definitely of the mind that was like, I didn't really care about any tactics, so to me it was like, eh. I use whoever I need to use to beat the fight, and that's good enough for me. There we go. Come on, get in there. So yeah, that's basically been my week. How you guys been doing, by the way, if you're watching this video, just watching this kind of go in the background. How you guys been doing? I've been doing alright. Can't complain too much. Doing a little bit more streaming now. Doing a little bit. Trying to find the right balance of streaming and also making videos. It helps that there's really nothing for Dragalia to do until the 2.5 year anniversary. Except for this like specific fight. The new hard fight. But like, I'm not anywhere near ready for it. If people who are better than me weren't ready for it, then what makes me think I'd be ready for it? So... And of course, Grace died, but it's okay. She always dies. She's not really needed, except for at the beginning. Um, so yeah, I've been doing a lot of that. It's been fun. Did someone die? Do not die on the really... The li okay, carry up and kill me. He's not going to be able to kill me. This is the one negative about the damn team. Is that there's a chance that the only ones left are this, and he's not strong enough to kill. There's He's literally not strong enough to kill her. Look how little damage he does to her. He can't kill her. So I have no choice but to hit retry. Let me hit that back, because I swear to god this team can beat it. So I'm just going to pause and I'm going to come back with them winning. Alright, here we are, back at them hopefully beating this fight in literally the next couple seconds. So here's the reason why I specifically never grinded any light weapons is this is a pain in the ass to auto um, and it's not fun to play by yourself. I think it's interesting one time when you go, oh, that's cool, and then it's not good anymore because he doesn't really deal a lot of damage, at least in his expert and standard form, which I have to get the, the <laughs> they have to get a bunch of the six expert forms if I want to get enough gold to uh, earn a weapon for someone. Um, but yeah, this fight sucks. It straight sucks. It sucks so bad. It's maybe my least favorite of the Agido. Um, if I were to rank the Agido, it'd probably be in terms of 
in enjoyment, it would probably be... I think Volk is the most enjoyable for me. Somehow, even though I think Volk is a pain in the ass. Next is Cayenne. <laughs> Somehow, even though I haven't... Again, this is for the specific, I guess, up until Master, because that's about where I've done them. Um, Legends, I don't know. Especially since there's only two with Legends, so up to Masters. Um, the Twins, I think, is... No, I think the Twins I hate as much as Tartarus. No, actually, it's less than Tartarus. Um, I think it's equally kind of a pain in the ass at times, though. Um, let me see. So I got that, okay. Um, oh, so they don't know anything about these goddamn cages, so I swear to god. If we lose again, because you don't go into the stupid fucking cage. Go in the cage. Usually he does it, but sometimes it's just like, just go in there, idiot. Um, man, am I for who am I forgetting of the Agidos? Oh, the boobied brown lady. The booby brown lady bunny. Um, actually, I think I like hers. The third. Yeah, so it goes Volk, Cayenne, Booby Brown Lady, the twins, and then this motherfucker. I hate this dude so much. Um, not because I think he's hard, I just think he's kind of annoying, and I think the gimmick sucks. Which is a shame, it seems like that's what they took into Lilith. It seems like that's what the kind of mindset they decided to go for. It's like, well, what if this was just super annoying? And the answer is, that's not fun. Volk I don't mind, because Volk can go down pretty easy, and except for the beginning part, um, it can instantly kill you if you're not paying attention, but it's not like super crazy like the old style H High Dragon Trials, where old High Dragon Trials were like, did you blink wrong? Alright, everyone reset, because one person died two seconds in, and we need to quickly restart everything. These Agidos aren't built that way, so it's much easier for me. Um, so, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, anyway, how's your week been doing? Mine's been okay. Been doing some other stuff. Trying to find balances and everything. Sometimes not meeting them. Sometimes thinking of specific video series that I want to do. And then going like, I can't, I don't have the knowledge and or time to do it justice so I don't do it. That ends up being the number one thing where it's like, oh man, I should do this. And then the answer is, I don't know if people will like that. I just don't know. And it can be very tough being in that situation, if I'm being honest. But, you know, do your best, see what happens. Oh! Of course. The, he activated the stupid fucking cage. I'm sure he'll enter the portal, right? You'll enter the damn 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 portal, right? You're a failure. We're a SETI. You're a failure at everything you try. You need to hurry up and let this go faster by releasing Julieta. Prostrate yourself, as always. There you go. She got him. Whoa, what? I have no idea what he was saying there. Yeah, not bad. Not bad, everyone. You guys are doing perfectly fine. No issues here. I think one last one to go. But yeah, that's the kind of my issue with why I never raise any light weapons. And for the people who eventually figured out, like, I think the reason was is that also pre the dragon update, the highest E-Tart um, auto was at a 70%. It's like, what? It's all because of the stupid gimmicks that are in this fight, specifically. I did not mean for this video to be I hate E-Tart, because it just ended up being that way, but when you know, <laughs> that's kind of my way of thinking of, like, as I look at this fight and I'm seeing what the CPU has to do. I really think it was a mistake to start with light. Uh, I think it would it was a, a huge mistake to start with light and water. Or maybe they should have had water first and then light. No, it, just in general, don't use light. This fight sucks so much that nobody wants to grind it for the stupid weapons. 
It's such a pain in the ass. And not a lot of people can do it as well. That's the other problem, is that the auto is not everyone can do it. And trying to find rooms for this specific kind of stuff is also a different kind of annoying. She got stuck in the goddamn nebula. I swear to God, Mara said, if you do not go into that fucking portal before this video ends, I swear to God, I will end you. Thank you. He will remember to learn. Good job. I also think the AI acts better if you go in times two, times 1.2 or times 0.1.5 speed. Um, but this is literally standard. Who cares? Just do do it right. And <laughs> the funny thing is that there has been situations where both Marset and Juliet have been caged, and <laughs> the fight just doesn't end because he doesn't actually have enough power to kill both of them. But yeah, that's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. If you did, you can always leave a like, tell me how you're doing, and I'll see you guys in the next video, whatever it might be. Goodbye, everyone.